What's up guys, Mike Sheffer here. We're here with Andrew K. Fit. What's up guys? We're gonna do a little instructional on how to pump up your chest and get that big chest, but just using dumbbells, guys. Pyramided, four sets of 12, uh, 50 pounds, 70 pounds, 95. Now we're getting ready to do our final set of 105s here. 105 for let's say eight reps. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, as many as you can, maybe 12, Failure. maybe eight. So we're just beginning on the incline press. We're gonna do four sets of eight to 10. We have 70 pounds here, just to minimize the shoulder stress because we just did flat press up to 95 pounds and our shoulders are already a little bit taxed. So we're going to hit the 30 degree angle. Maybe we'll hit 15 as well, but no lower than 15 and no higher than 30. We're trying to engage the upper chest and no shoulder engagement. A lot of people, when they do incline presses or incline flies, have the bench much too inclined and it puts too much stress on the shoulders and you don't get a proper engagement of the upper chest. So. Yeah, and we're finishing off this chest press with some inclined flies. We're going for around 25 to 27 pounds, and we're getting around 12 to 15 reps. Yeah, really focus on that big stretch when you do the inclined flies, and a big squeeze of the upper chest at the top. Awesome, watch us do this set. So notice guys how Andrew rolls the dumbbells in the hex press towards his chest and then rolls them out. What that does is it gets your upper chest a lot more engaged during the exercise. Okay guys, so anytime you're doing a fly motion, because you're using dumbbells, the tension is going to release at the top if you bring them all the way to the top. So the, tr the trick that I use is when I get up to the top, I don't go all the way up, but I really focus on squeezing my chest no right. matter what. So I, I squeeze my chest at the top, hold that squeeze until I start doing the eccentric of the motion. So, yeah. So that's what you do too? Pretty much. So we've got a lighter weight going on here. We only went up to 35 pounds, I believe. And we went for 15 to 20 reps, but the whole point of this movement was the tempo. We went slow negative and a quite a slow positive movement too. So we focus strictly on the pump. We're not focusing on pressing like 50 pounds or anything. We want to feel every single rep. Time under tension is what it is. That's right. set to finish it off. Did push-ups to failure, three sets. Okay, good pump in the chest, nice slow controlled. Andrew just finished his now. Last but not least, make sure you guys stretch out your chest. It's gonna help with growth, help with mobility, and help with your overall physique and aesthetics.